you're keeping it separate because you know you have your assets that you're protecting yes, yes. your home at assets yep. and then the business assets so that's mm -hmm. that's really the the big reason that you would we would yeah, come the, to you yeah. the crux of it is yeah reinstating the the corporate veil the corporate shield i mean the the limited liability corporation liability is limited to the corporation only until you start signing all those personal guarantees and then you're piercing that veil and it's it opens up things to yeah i mean uh, your house your your 401k anything that uh, is is on the promissory note i mean that that you own you've got to pay it back um i mean uh, this is an old statistic from 2022 but the uh, the sba you know saw took a poll nearly 500 or nearly 600,000 595,000 small businesses closed and on average, that left the business owner with $83,000 of business debt to a business that no longer exists, but is personally guaranteed, and they still have to pay it back.